Morgi out of the backfield, makes a man miss. Tripped up though, down to the 15. Balin Buchanan got just enough. Go. Hard, hard. Morgi. Nice burst. Match Morgi. In zone. Roughnecks do it again. So Borgi used to scoring touchdowns, but he's playing for Leach and Rolovich, not used to caring for the touchdown. Blend it, blend it. Go. Uh, hunt. Out of the backfield to Borgi. And brought down, and not after getting into Orlando territory. McDonald remains at quarterback. Motion in, give up the middle, touchdown Max Borgie. Negated the interception, and Max Borgie comes up big. Houston on top. The one point will put you at 38, but the number is 39. You have the minus four and a half right now, and you have no one point conversion. All right. And a handoff, get it straight up the middle. The huge run for Borgi. Made the first man miss, made the second man pay. It's a gain of 12 yards. He's, he, he's a fan of the videos. We collabed way back in the days. He's like, bro, I got this idea. I want to put on a mask and compete during your one-on-ones. And it was a show, man. It was spectacular. He balled out, did his thing. But there were some guys that were there kind of giving him a run for his money. So it was dope. It was dope. I know. Brandon Silver is the quarterback, and there is the shovel pass to Max Borgie. Borgie to the 30, sidestepping, and a nice game to start it off. But you would have burned your timeout and lost your challenge for the game if you were Houston. Borgie, and it's now seven straight completions for Silver. He slips out of a neck tackle. Your defense puts uh -huh. so much pressure on quarterbacks. How does that open up you guys to make plays? Uh, the, the, the pass rush and coverage run together. So, you know, as long as we're working together, we feed off each other, we come up with plays like that. That's the leading touchdown maker in the NX XFL. Borgie, open field stop. Made by Mikel Wright. Houston staying with Silvers. Borgie looking for the second effort. He's tackled into the end zone. It took a while, but Houston is on the board. There we go. And after they got it, Borgie finding his way. Seeing right now from DC. McDonald gives to Borgie, breaks tackles, first down, Houston inside the DC 30. Borgie. Room to room, touchdown, Houston. The team that they decide to go with, they just bring the H back, back across the line of scrimmage, secure the back side, and then it's third and a mile with the clock running. And just hand it off to Borgie. And he gets it to midfield. They're falling down at the bottom, oh, no. you see that? Yeah, there is. There's a break in the beer snake, and Borgie scores. It's a... 14 point game. We'll see what Houston decides to do. Offense and, and again the threat of the quarterback run. He hands it off and Max Borgie's so diminutive and stat. Max Borgie now in a running back. And he gets forward enough to pick it up. Willie Harvey. Here's Borgie for Washington State Cougar. And he slips through. Somehow he pounded through and he ends up with a 23-yard gain. He's so good in third down. He's so much stronger than you think. He always seems to make initial contact miss. And he's a great contributor in the passing game. 50% completion percentage in the first half. And Max Borgie picks up six yards. Ripper with the, <laughs> the quick throw, but I like Fox here. Here's Max Borgie. Wow. Max Borgie's able to pick up the first down thanks to Derry and Parker. Cole, what have you thought of the Roughnecks offensive line today? Of a run threat at the quarterback spot. 
touchdown and one pick last week against St. Louis. Max Borgie gets a handoff. And he's got enough for the first down. Down the sideline, Borgie with an over the shoulder grab. It's a pickup of 20. Go. Borgie trying to dance to the outside. He gets submarine at the eight yard line by Luke Barku. I mean, if he goes, what if he goes to Cincinnati? How weird will that be? <laughs> well, he's meeting with the Ravens this week. Here's a swing out to Borgie. And he gets bottled up. And I like it a lot. There's only two guys on the left-hand side. Borgie has space. And he picks up the first down. It turns into a simple math equation, huh? After the Braves walk off on night one. Silvers swings it out. And Max Borgie stays in bounds and found some room and takes it all the way down inside the 40. Silvers 4-5 or five to start the game. That's easy. He's able to find Borgie. He took a lick. And right into DJ Calhoun. And ran right by him, and Borgie bounces to the outside. And Houston is taking control of this game on a long run of 22 yards by Max Borgie. Here's Borgie straight up the gut, and he plunges in for the touchdown. First offensive touchdown for the Roughnecks today. The defense has contributed too. Very nice job here by Houston's offensive line. Good job at the point of attack. You saw number 21, Garrett Owens. They are crazy thin, especially in the third phase being the special teams units. Here's Max Borgie. And he slips through the first tackler. He's got a first down for Houston, and he's still on his feet. Inside the 15, what a run for Borgie. It goes for 36 yards, and they had him dead to rights multiple times. Just great effort by Borgie. Great cutback, sees the field to the outside, cuts back to his right, runs through a couple of would-be tacklers until he finally... All right. Rides Borgie up the middle. There's a big chunk for Houston across to Arlington territory. Gain of 14 brought down by Will Hill. He finished runner-up oh. to right. Bo Jackson. How'd that work out for Bo? Borgie, big play. Gain of 13.